I love acting, but I always knew that the thing that really turned me on was the filmmaking process. This is Bradley Cooper, the director. During the December 14th episode of Variety's Directors on Directors, the maestro star lets Spike Lee in on his filmmaking process, sharing how it shifts when he's both the actor and director. I don't watch playback. Uh, to me, rhythm no of the day. Back. Here's what I'll do. I'll tell okay. you in a second. So there's no chairs on sets. I've always hated chairs, and I feel like your energy dips the minute you sit down in the chair. So Apple Box is a very nice way, way to sit, mm -hmm. and everybody's together. There's no video village. No, there's a, I, I hate that. But Bradley stresses that's just his preference. When he's on someone else's set, he follows their lead. If you're with me, yeah, there's no video village. Yeah, when I ask you to come act in it, yeah. No, I'm asking you. When I'm, when I'm directing, you're I'll do whatever you say. I'm your actor. In fact, Bradley credits his decades as an actor for shaping his creative process. I was a filmmaker, but I was living in the but I was in the position of an actor, and I learned how to help the director by being on the field. So for me, it was such a natural transition once I had the the courage to write and direct a movie that being on the field is where I feel most comfortable to direct actually and again Spike I think it's because I became so aware as an actor of the movement of the camera and the composition that it feels second nature to me and it's that experience that he draws upon when creating a comfortable environment for his actors I want to make actors feel feel safe to be fearless. In making his transition to directing, the Oscar nominee emphasizes how grateful he is for the directors who took him under their wing. I spent 20 some odd years acting in movies and I was lucky enough that I had filmmakers who recognized that, that I don't think like an actor, that I actually think like in the macro of the whole story and they were generous enough to allow me come with them on their on their journey way more than what an actor would have done. Ultimately, Bradley's passion for storytelling led to his directorial debut with 2018's A Star Is Born. At the time, he told E! News, there were things I wanted to talk about in a movie, and I wanted to have a point of view about trauma as a child, family, what it means to find your voice in this world, and a place to say it.